Hello everyone, I thought of a pretty fun and creative cool video idea to make for you guys and this idea is essentially explaining the differences um, with Injustice Gods Among Us Mobile and Mortal Kombat. Um, this video is either going to be titled The Differences Between the Two Games, The Differences Between Injustice Gods Among Us Mobile and Mortal Kombat Mobile. Or it's going to be titled, um, it's going to be titled, it's going to be titled Injustice Gods Among Us Mobile versus MK Mobile. So, first of all, um, I have been a veteran Injustice Gods Among Us Mobile and been playing the game since 2013. And I can confidently tell you guys that the gameplay is extremely different. Um, if you're thinking about playing the game, um, it's so the uh, the speed of injustice. It's um, it's a lot faster. So in Mortal Kombat Mobile, I would actually argue that the fighting aspect of the game is more realistic. Um, like, it's kind of hard to explain, but um, in Mortal Kombat, on like the uh, combo enders and things like that, you can basically get a away with a lot more in Mortal Kombat versus Injustice Gods Among Us Mobile. Injustice Gods Among Us Mobile is much more straightforward. Um, in Mortal Kombat Mobile, the, the fight pace is just a lot slower. Um, so you can just do a lot more. And then the second thing that I'm going to mention is perks. So I can actually load up the games. This is kind of going to be a crazy video. Because I'm going to load up two games in the same video. But I'm going to show you guys. Okay, cool. Uh. All right, so it loaded me into the tutorial version. There's tutorials for both games. Um, there's also no brutality and injustice. Gods Among Us Mobile. Um, all right, so yeah, so that's one thing. There's no like special three is a lot different. There's also no blood and injustice, guys among us mobile. So, um, basically, a huge gameplay difference is you can just do unlimited um, special attacks as well. So, there's really no cap to it. You can kind of just do unlimited special attacks, which is very interesting, um, to say the least. And then the perks are extremely different. I don't even need to explain that. You would kind of just have to see um, with the diamond cards. So in Injustice Gods Among Us Mobile, there is, I think it's, uh, there's ninth metal cards. Do I have any? Okay, I have one. Cool. So, Batman, who laughs has a chance. Choose a tarot card that triggers a powerful effect, which can aid his teammates or harm the opponent on teammate tagging. Plus. Oh, 
Okay, so actually the perks are kind of similar. Um, there's like two perks on each ninth, I mean, diamond card, and it's kind of similar with this. But the difference is in Mortal Kombat Mobile is the diamond card comes with two perks. In this one, it you kind of have to evolve for it. See, it says evolve. So that's the difference there. And then challenges. There's no real difference with the challenges. Um, I would say the biggest difference is in Injustice, there's no ninth medal in the challenges. But in Mortal Kombat Mobile, there's ninth medal. Or there's souls. So you can earn souls to get like diamond cards. Whereas in Injustice, you can't do that. You have to um, do, you have to find other ways to get ninth medal cards, ninth medal credits. So it's a lot harder in that aspect. Um, also, online battle versus uh, faction wars is also different as well. Um, online battle, you have an actual designated reward that you're working towards whereas in Mortal Kombat Mobile you just get diamond packs and the chances of the diamonds just increase and decrease based on the um based on the uh progression of your account I mean the progression of your faction wars or online battle <sighs> and that's really it um also, in this game, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, I was going to say that I prefer the faction war strategy a lot more than online battle. Because I think it just rewards the player a lot more for getting a higher tier. But so does Injustice because, you know, you get more characters if you get, like, first place, second. But yeah, I personally think MK Mobile did a better job with their faction wars, just my opinion, and the challenges as well. Um, gameplay, I think it's pretty even. I think Injustice is better if you don't like a game with blood, but Mortal Kombat Mobile is better if you like a slower paced gameplay, more realistic. So I think Injustice and MK Mobile are pretty equal when it comes to that. yeah mk mobile obviously has um more gear card upgrades than than injustice so that's also something but um injustice seems to update their packs pretty often but i think um mk mobile does a better job of that as well now on to augments Augments are kind of like support cards when it comes to like Injustice. I think it's very similar in that sense. But the only difference is in Injustice, there's no limit. There's a limit in uh, MK Mobile, which is interesting. But yeah, very interesting. <sighs> now, is there anything else? Mm. Also, Mortal Kombat Mobile is constantly being updated with new game modes. So we'll see what Injustice Gods Among Us has to hold. But nonetheless, they're both amazing games. Warner Bros. did an amazing job with both of these games. So. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you're new. And would like to see more videos.